Got the M14 uh, stock in today. Had the uh, composite stock on it. Took it out and put it in this USGI stock. And they fit just like a glove. You can see it's got a few nicks and dings on it here. But uh, that's kind of what I wanted. Something that, that looked like it's been well used. They even got a had a cover that top handguard. I've had it for a while. I got it at a gun show, and you can see it's nicked and ding and got minor finishing cracks in it. That's okay. It's all structurally sound. It just looks like it's been battle worn. There's the government cartouche on it. Got the butt plate. That's all bolted on nice and neat like it's supposed to. Flip it over here. As you can see there, it's got the hole there. That's where the automatic and semi-automatic selector switch used to be on this thing when it was a government rifle. So as you can see, it came out real good. Again, more more minor dings and scrapes on it, but it's nothing, no big deal. And again, this one come out doesn't have a bayonet lug per se on it, but uh, we'll get that switched over here eventually. But overall, it came out exactly like I wanted. There's some more scratches and dings on it. Who knows where that came from, but overall, I'm real happy with it. It's exactly what I wanted to come out with. Looks real good.